Hello guys, welcome back to another Android app development tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about how to display a toast message. So basically, toast message is used to provide a simple feedback like a pop-up message. And by default, it displays at the bottom area of any Android devices. So if you further require to display it on a specific position, then you can do so by calling set gravity on it. Hi, my name is Swajit and I make videos on Android app development. So if you haven't subscribed this channel yet, then please consider subscribe and hit the like button that encourages me to make more contents. So let's get started. Alright, so as you can see guys, I have already created a simple Hello World project where we have a text view with it. So at first I'm going to replace this text view with button tag. Then I will also change the text. Let's say display toast. Now I'll add a on click attribute. On click. Let's name it display toast. Now we have to create a method called display toast in mainactivity.java. So I'll simply press alt enter then choose create display option. So whenever we will press the display toast button this method will be invoked every time. And inside this method I'll write few lines of code to display a pop-up message which will be the toast message actually. So first let's create toast variable called mtoast. Then mtoast equal to toast dot make text. Now in this make toast methods parameter we have to pass three arguments. First one is the context then then a message which we are going to display on the screen then the duration of the toast. So I'm going to pass the context by calling get application context. Then a message, let's say welcome to toaster. Then we also have to pass the duration. So toast dot length. And as you can see, we have two constants available for that. Length short and length long. So for now I will select length sort then semicolon. Now let's assume we need to display the toast at the top of our screen. Otherwise it will display at the bottom area by default. In such case we can call mtoast dot set gravity. Then gravity dot and here you can see all the available constant fields which we can use according to our needs. So for now I will select the top constant. Then we also have to pass two more arguments for x axis and y axis. So I am going to pass 0 for x axis and 0 again for y axis. Now to display the toast simply call mtoast dot so. And that's it. Now I am going to build the project to see in action. Let's press the button. You can see the pop-up message at the top area of our screen. Now what if you want to display it to the top right side at which the toast should appear on the screen. You can use X offset and Y offset properties. So I'm going to pass 100 to its X offset and you can also pass a negative value. So positive value will move it to the right side and negative value will move it to the left side. Let's build the project again to see all the changes. Let's press the button. As you can see this time our toast message is little bit moved to the left side because of negative value. Anyway let's change this value to 300. Let's test it again.
Now you can see the toast is completely moved to the right side. Now let me just show you the final thing to position our toast. So I'm going to change this value to zero again. And beside gravity top property, you can also use another gravity attribute, something like this. Pipe, then gravity dot, let's say end. It means if I build and run this code, it will appear at the right top corner of the screen. And press the button. Like I said, toast is appearing at the right top corner. And you can play with those gravity attributes to positioning a toast. Anyway, now I would like to show you another way to express all these code in one single line. So I'm going to comment these lines. Then simply type toast, then hit tab, and Android Studio will generate all the required code. So it takes this as the context, then the message, let's say test message for now. Now build the project to see the changes. Let's press the button, and as you can see, the toast is actually appearing at the bottom area of the screen, which is the default position. So if this simple text message isn't enough, then you can create a customized layout for your toast message, which will be explained in the next video. So guys, if you still have any questions or suggestions, please drop your message in the comment box. And if you think you have learned something new today, hit the like button. Share with your friends and of course subscribe for more content. That's all for now guys. See you soon in the next one. Thanks for listening.